What's going on, guys? And welcome back to some more Earthbound. In the last part, um, we made it through the, uh, the, uh, waterfall next to our Saturn Valley. We made it back to Saturn Valley. And in this part, we're gonna do another then. If we actually go up here for a second, um, in this part, we're gonna do another then, um, if I'm trying to get this, uh, correct, um, see what we have in the ATM, because uh, I'm gonna wanna buy some, uh, things we might need. Let's take out uh, $4,000. Yeah, I'm gonna buy some Point of Life because uh, we might need it for this area. If we're gonna carry this and don't tell me. Okay, Paul can carry two Horns of Life. I don't normally get Horns of Life in pleasure, but uh, I guess I can do this. Um, Horn of Life. Uh, we don't have enough cash. So, yeah, Paul can carry two horns of life. Anyway, so, um, yeah, I already explained this, but the horn of life is basically, uh, what, uh, it's basically like a cup of life needles that they kill you fully. Talk to this guy. Drink coffee before I go. Say yes to me. Say no to me. Yes. Bottoms up, boy. You've traveled very far from home. Do you remember how long your long and winding journey began with someone pounding at your door? It was Pokey, the worst person in your neighborhood who knocked on the door that fateful night. On your way, you have watched, thought, thought, and fought. Yet through all this, you have never lost your courage. You have grown steadily stronger, though you have uh, experienced the pain of battle many times. You are no longer alone in your adventures. Paula, who is steadfast, kind, and even pretty, is always at your side. Jeff is going to do as well. Though he is timid, he came from a distant land to help you. Ness, as you certainly know by now, you are not a regular young man. You have an awesome destiny to fulfill. The journey from this point will be long and it will be more difficult than anything you have undergone to this point. Yet I know you will be alright. When you good, when good battles evil, which side do you believe wins? Do you have faith that good is triumphant? One thing you must never lose is courage. If you believe in the goal you are striving for, you will be courageous. There are many difficult times ahead, but you, will keep your, you must keep your sense of humor, walk, work through the tough situations, and enjoy yourself. When you finish this cup of coffee, your adventure will begin again. Next time, next you must pass through a vast desert and proceed to the big city of Four Sides. Ness, Paula, yeah. I wish you luck. Anyway, so sorry for that little audio thing right there. I had the wrong settings in my mixing software, and I was able to catch that just in time to avoid this being a failed recording. Anyway, so sorry for the first couple minutes without audio. Oh, fuck. Here's the cameraman. Say it, Derek. He 
pictures taken instantaneously. I'm a photographic genius. I do say so myself. Okay, we're going to finish the memory. Look at the camera. Ready? Say plus. What a great photograph. It'll always bring back the fondest of memories. Anyway, this area. This is a... Uh, yeah, these are some pretty bad enemies, and pretty bad enemy placement, too. Bunch of new enemies! These are the, uh, tough mobile sprouts. They're like the other mobile sprouts, it's like strong, stronger, more of a pain in the ass. They will basically spew seeds, and like, kill like basically everything the first mobile sprout said. This is the strutting evil mushroom, which is, uh, a more strong, a stronger version of the mushrooms we fought in Tucson. These will also inflict spore damage, so like, if one character gets spored, you have to go back to the, uh, lake and the that little puddle in uh Saturn Valley and basically kinda kill us. Now uh I'm gonna kinda like uh use a uh, focus on the I'm gonna use PSI fire beta. I'm gonna focus my attacks on the short little mushroom because I don't wanna get scored. Oh my god. Fuck you We're not even two we're not even like We're not even we're only like minutes in this fucking recording this happens. Yeah, we don't want to- Alright, thank god. Okay, you want to defend me, Sword. The Rain Bob can, can- They can also use a CS, PSI Alpha. Thank god. Thank first battle in this area. Paul is now level 24, offense went up by 2, defense went up by 1, came up by 1, I guess went up by 2, I came up by 1. Luck went up by 2, Maxi came up by 2, Maxi came up by 5, Ma Power of power PSI Magnet Omega. I'm gonna have to. Yeah, every time you get scored, this is probably one of my least favorite. This is probably my least favorite sanctuary area to go to in the game. Yeah, so if you do that, that gets rid of your uh that gets rid of uh of spore damage. But like, yeah. You can literally get screwed because of bad enemy placement. Okay, there's no, there's no uh, evil mushrooms. Okay, so we're going to, uh, I'm gonna focus on the rain bob, then I'm gonna use PSI Fire Beta. They will no shield alpha though, that's the problem. And it looks like it dodged quickly. Alright, yeah. Just get rid of the. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, but now level 24. Oh, baby. Offense went up by 3. Oh, baby. Defense went up by 3. Gus went up by 2. My talent went up by 1. I came up by 1. Luck went up by 2. Maxi came up by 11. Alright, as long as we don't get spored again, because we really don't. I. No, no, no. I have no choice. I have no choice. That's better enemy placement. No, it's not better enemy placement. If I get to get scored again... Yeah, you want to take any enemy that can give you scores, you want to take out first. Don't pull it faster. Why didn't you kill the other one? No! No! This is why, like... Could have sworn I attacked that evil mushroom. Fuck you, you're dead. This is the first area in this game, and we're already scored. And I need Paula, so like, um... I'm gonna have to, uh... I don't get any enemies, thankfully. I guess we can get the XP from this. I don't want Paula to be scored because I'm gonna need her PP for the boss. Unfortunately, PSI Healing Beta does not get rid of scores. You're packed the wrong enemy, and thank god. 
I swear to God, I'm gonna get some. Oh, these uh, they also go to sleep, and uh, guess what? I'm gonna have to uh. Heal also. Ness is now level 27. Oh, baby, offense went up by 4, defense went up by 1, speed up by 1, guts went up by 1, but went up by 1, max speed by 11, max speed went up by 2, and hypnosis omega. Paul level 25, max speed went up by 3, max speed went up by 2, max and realize Thunder Beta, yes! Thunder Beta is like Thunder Alpha, so that it pulls off more attacks. Unfortunately, though, we are gonna have to go heal. I'm like 10 full minutes in this video and I've not even gotten past the- gone to the Sanctuary boss yet. So yeah, this is gonna be a fuck, but um... Cause like... There's- I'm seeing like after you get more party members, there's the occasional annoying part of Earthbound. I'd say this is one of them. And wait to see what, what the boss is capable of, because the boss is actually capable of inflicting a status that we're, we have not seen yet. Working through the night, Jeff was the airbound and became the Mega Man. Actually, we can equip that. Unfortunately, though, um, it, um, let's see. Actually, increases our offense, so yes. This will help drastically. Okay, how many broken items does Jeff have? Let's see, he has the, uh, he has the broken laser. Maybe we can fix that. Maybe we can, we can maybe fix the broken laser. No. Once we fix the broken later, that'll be a step up from what we have with the Magnum Mirror Gun. I can get my PP back up. I'm. I'm kind of close to everyone to like level up and all that. Like Paula, um, Jeff's kind of close to a level up. Um, one more battle will do it. But like. Yeah, I guess you should probably get, like, Paul and Jeff level 25 for coming here. I don't want to fight these stupid mushrooms. I'm going to manipulate the enemy placement until I get what I want. No. I am going to do this. I'm going to manipulate the enemy placement until I get what I want. All right, thank you. Because I have to think about Earthbound because I'm particularly... I, sometimes they can be, like... Things like that way, way to ambush you, and sometimes there won't be. You, of course, you have to mess. And thank God, and uh, okay, I didn't think I didn't kill the shiny monster. Yeah, we're not gonna use any PS. We're only gonna use PSI attacks. Like, do you think about like when you enter caves that's like this? That sometimes there can be enemies waiting to ambush you, and sometimes there won't be like here. Cause like this isn't a particularly long cave. There's only this is the second section. There's only three sections left. And they're gonna put up some shield alpha or a pack. More hit should do. No, you have to. Thank you. You're dead. Of course, they have to pull up the shield alpha. Fortunately, Ness is asleep. The shield disappeared, thankfully. I'm Paula dying. Thank you. Jeff is now level 25. Speed up by 1, Max is speed up by 3. Now, we are fortunately going to have to use life up alpha on Paula. Right? We're also going to have to use it on Jeff, too. And more tough, more boss sprouts. All right, now we got that fire of a system. I don't want to get any more. We're almost at the boss. We are almost at the boss. It's like make this as long, make this area as long as possible. Make this also as much a pain in the ass possible. Because if you get scored, you have to pretty much go back to Saturn Valley and get healed. Damn okay, it, he's life up. Paula can survive another hit, she can't survive two hits. Oh, 
Because so we're on the point in the game we're also gonna encounter enemies that are kind of the same as before, except stronger. Like, these are like the mobile frogs that are stronger. We didn't get a level up out of this. Alright, more, no more enemies. I don't really want them. And what's in here? Um, the corner slumber. We're gonna give that to Paula. Because, uh, let's see. I don't need the hand aid anymore. But yeah, we're gonna give that coin of slumber to Paula because, uh, she'd be more vulnerable. It's a defensive upgrade. It's basically gonna get rid of the, uh, it's basically an upgrade from the red ribbon. Raise the defense to 55. Ladies and gentlemen, it's Sanctuary Boss time. This is a pretty annoying Sanctuary Boss at that. You finally got here. This is the third your Sanctuary location, but it's mine now. Take it from me if you dare. This is the Trillion Age Sprout. Now, one tip I have that I didn't elaborate on earlier. Save as much PP as possible because, uh, he will have two uh, tough mobile routes, and uh, if we use PSI Mario Beta, and we use PSI Fire Beta as a backup, it'll get rid of both of them. Then, another tip I have, if you still have the big bottle rocket that came, that, uh, came with Jeff in his inventory, use it right here, because, uh, the Trillion Trout can inflict some stats, like, um, the stat you don't want him to inflict on you is a new stat that's, uh, that's, uh, What's it called? I'm trying to think. It's like numbness. It's not. It's not numbness. It's a. It's basically like a stone. A stone condition, and it acts like a character dying. You have to go to the hospital to get it healed. And he'll basically. Uh, he'll mobilize you. That's what it is. That's it. It's basically like uh, a character dying, and you don't want this on any of our party members. And they did 430 damage. We're gonna use life up on Paula. We're gonna use a PSI fire beta. We might as well use our bottle rocket. We want to go all in on this guy. He's kind of a pain in the ass. We use fire beta. Oh shit! Yeah, this is gonna start crying. Flash Alpha will start. Crying. These are the, the crying status. So uh. Time for PSI Mario and uh, PSI Mario Beta, PSI Fire Fair. As long as it's spam PSI attack, we shouldn't have too much of a problem. Oh, Jeff ran out of inventory. Jeff ran out of bar rockets, so um, turn out to be being tame, so that wasn't that bad. Ness is now level 28. Offense went up by 2, defense went up by 2, speed went up by 1. Guts went up by one. Vitality went up by one. IQ went up by two. Luck went up by two. Max AP went up by 15. That rocks. Max AP went up by eight. Paul is now level 26. Offense went up by two. AP went up by two. Vitality went up by one. IQ went up by one. Max AP went up by 14. Max AP went up by three. Jeff is now level 26. Offense went up by one. IQ went up by one. Max AP went up by two. All right. This is the third sanctuary location. Instantly heard his mother from far away, she said. Be a thoughtful, strong boy. Sounds how I recorded the melody of the Milky Well. Next time on Earthbound, we're going to go back to Freed. See you guys then.